So here I have the Z-Port wireless camera and on the bo box it says 100% wire free. So we're going to see how this works. I've already taken this out and played around with it a little bit. But in the box you'll find the actual camera unit itself it has a little indentation right here on the back, a little cable port, and then behind this panel here is where some of the wires will plug in for charging it when the battery runs out. In the box you'll find this little red adhesive. It's double-sided adhesive that peels off on both sides of it. And what you'll do is you'll take that red adhesive, put it on the bottom of the base, which I have installed right here. So it just has that little red piece on the underside of it. So there's no wires underneath this, and it's magnetic. So the camera here just pops right on it and stays like that. We are installing the new camera. Comes with a mount. He, pre he put some pre drilled holes in. Now he's just going to screw in the camera piece. Okay, and now we're going to go ahead and check out the camera on the phone, which we already
there it is. And then we can also speak on the camera. So if we wanted to say something to someone, if they were back here, we could speak on it. It's very easy to use, has a six month battery life. I would totally recommend this one. Overall, I'm really impressed with the quality of this camera, given the price point. As you can see on the back here, we have a port for the SD card. I think I've got a 128 gig capacity card in there right now, and the quality is just fine. Uh, then beneath that, this camera also comes with a rechargeable battery. So this is the micro USB port for that. Uh, my plan is just to leave it plugged in all the time so I don't ever have to recharge it. Uh, and then we've got the power button and a reset button up here as well. It also comes with two pieces of mounting hardware. I've got one attached here. I haven't decided where I'm going to mount this camera yet. So just for demonstration purposes, uh, this is essentially just a swivel um, and it'll, uh, you know, rotate to whichever degree that you need uh, for mounting it horizontally. It also comes with a metal half sphere, which is really nice and convenient if you want to mount this vertically. Uh, so this is metal and then the magnets on the back of the camera and that'll essentially, you know, rotate to whatever degree that you need it to. Um, it also comes with screws and anchors. So if you want to mount this somewhere and it's permanent, that's probably a good way to go. But it also comes with double sided 3M tape. Uh, there's a couple pieces of this. So that's nice for moving the camera around. And then as far as viewing the camera, um, the Android app that it comes with is called Cloud Edge, all one word. And it's about 8.30 p.m. Central Time right now, so it's pretty dark outside. And the quality here is pretty good, even, in, even for the evening. So I've got a little bit of a glare. Let me close these curtains. And that's what you can see from the app. So in my opinion, 1080p, uh, pretty good quality. So right here we have the Z port smart ip camera with battery this is what the camera itself looks like you can see it's not very big it's good sized so it's not very obvious if you want to hide it and overall i think it's a cool concept having a completely wireless security camera it's pretty nice if uh you don't have any space to run wires where you want the camera put you just need a good Wi-Fi signal right here the camera is actually on right now you can see that it's connected it still has the film on it's pretty easy to turn on all you do push and hold the power button for five seconds there's a tiny reset hole right there space for SD card and then charging port right there right now I have a 32 gigabyte SD card in there and that's uh not the biggest but it's decent and the way it records it does it I have mine set for 20 second intervals so it stores video for every 20 seconds and once the space fills all the way up it deletes the oldest videos and on here on the app there's a lot of cool features. You have, actually, I'll do this. So you can take a screenshot of the current video, access the photos. So I just took a screenshot of that. It has an intercom, which is nice because you can talk into it and voice will come out of this. So let's try this right here. Testing one, two, so I don't want to do it long because it'll just echo, but that's a pretty cool feature. So if you have this set up at your door and someone's there, but, you know, say you're in the bathroom and you can't get to the door, you can get in the intercom, oh, I'll be there in a second. So it's a pretty nice feature to have. It also has record where you can just manually record video. And it'll save that and then motion detection. So when this is turned off, you won't get any alerts about any movement on the camera, but when it's turned on and there's a significant movement on the camera, 
you'll get a notification on your phone. So let's see if this, if I move the camera around a lot. Hmm. Well, I'd have to look more into how the motion detection feature actually works, but it seems pretty cool. Overall, this is a very cool concept. You can see this tells you your battery percentage right there. Wow, the camera's hard to focus in on that. Yeah, so right now it's at full percentage. And it seems like a, you might want to have it plugged in if you're going to be running this camera 24-7 could be very difficult to worry about recharging the battery while it's while it's running and while you want it um, monitoring in a certain spot and then I'll also show you what it comes with it comes with charging cable screws to mount for two different mounts and it has a mount that looks like this which screws on underneath and then this can be screwed in to a wall or, or something like that and then this one I actually like this one the best because it's magnetic and you can see that's a pretty powerful magnet right there so this itself you just put a screw in the wall hook that in then you can have it angled different ways too oh we just got an alert for that's an alert that means there was significant motion detected on the screen. So overall, I think this is a pretty cool camera. It's definitely worth it. I give it four out of five stars.